how can changing your approach to life dramatically shift your personal happiness? I'm going to show you how three gems of tantric wisdom can change the way that you approach reality and dramatically increase your level of happiness. So I am going to give you full disclosure here. I've been a lifelong follower and lover of the tantric path. I spent six years in Asia working with tantric masters. It is one of the most sacred and beautiful things in my life. And I'd like to give you just a taste of the wisdom today. So I'm Layla Martin and this is The Sexy Revolution. The first gem is the tantric approach to self-love, which says that self-love is actually a substance that fills you up from the inside out, that it is fundamental to being a powerful human being. So self-love isn't something that you do at the end of the day, it's at the bottom of your checklist. It's not something you do after you've accomplished everything else in your life. Self-love is actually the key to an empowered existence. And what it does is it's actually equivalent to the strength of your immune system and not just your immune system to stay healthy from things like disease or aging, but it is actually an immunity against things like internal negativity, self-criticism, self-doubt, and other people's judgments of you. So self-love empowers you to live with a kind of power that makes you sparkle throughout your life. The second gem of wisdom is that Tantra says that every single part of you is sacred. That means that there aren't some parts of you that are bad or deserve to be punished or wrong in some way. And there aren't other parts of you that are good and acceptable and you should only try and be those parts. Tantra says all of you, the whole of your humanity, the whole of what you are is worthy of love, worthy of acceptance and sacred. It's actually holy. We as women are sensitive. If you feel that part of you is not okay, if you play victim your entire life, if you feel disempowered about who you are, you're going to constantly be in an internal struggle. You're going to constantly feel like you need to fix yourself rather than um, allowing your talents, rather than allowing yourself to live your life at full throttle. And so the tantric approach to all of you being sacred actually gives you the power to express who and what you fully are in this lifetime. The third gem of tantric wisdom is that the feminine, to be a woman, is actually equivalent with universal power. So there can be this idea in our society that a woman ought to be passive. You ought to wait for someone to ask you out. You ought to wait for life to come to you. Tantra actually says that the nature of the feminine, which can show up in men and women, is to be powerful. It's to manifest. It's to create. So it is in your nature to build hugely successful businesses, to be financially abundant, to create dance and music and works of art and literature that change the world to be radiant and full and bring yourself fully to life. So how would your life be different if you didn't approach being a woman as something less than or small or that you need to get everyone else's needs met before yours, but that one of the big pieces of a woman's nature is to make shit happen. So these are the gems of tantric wisdom, but they're just a tiny little piece because it's actually infinite, this path, what I could share with you. And in upcoming videos, I'll be sharing practical tools, tips, ways that you can actually use tantra in your life and more about what this system actually is. And my upcoming course, Oh Bliss, which so many of you are already really excited about, I'm so happy about that, is going to be coming up in early September. And there's going to be lots of really practical applications for how you can embody this kind of wisdom in your life. If you're loving this content, head over to laylamartin.com, sign up with your email address, join the community, get these kinds of amazing um, inspirational gems every week. Go ahead and like us below on Facebook. Let's spread the word to as many women as possible. And finally, let me know in the comment section below, what was your big aha moment? What out of this video gave you the biggest sense of transformation that's going to change your life?